Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your Six Studios. Today in this video, I'm going to go and show you an easy way to restart your computer and get the BIOS menus so you can go ahead and change any setting you want on your Windows computer. So let's go ahead and jump in the video right now. So the method I'm going to show you is an alternative method. Now the typical method is you would restart your computer and you would keep tapping the delete key until you entered the BIOS menu. Or maybe it could be the F12 key, the F9 key, or maybe the F2 key. And it will flash a quick screen where it will say press F12 for this, etc. And you only have like a half a second to read what it says. But this method, it will launch your computer directly into BIOS without having to read what's on the screen very briefly. Okay, so now on our Windows computer's desktop, let's go down to the Windows Start button right here, and select this, then go over to Settings. Now go over to Update and Security. Select this, then under here, let's go to Recovery then go to Advanced Startup, and go to Restart Now. And it's gonna restart your computer, and boot into a blue screen. So these are the options we are provided. We wanna to go to Troubleshoot, then go to Advanced Options, then go to UEFI Firmware Settings, and select this. Now, go to Restart. And it's going to go once again restart your computers, and when it does restart, it will launch into BIOS. Alright, so this is BIOS. So on the top we have MIT System BIOS Peripherals Chipset Power Save and Exit. So anytime you make a change in BIOS, you want to go over to Save and Exit, and then go to Save and Exit Setup. So then select this and press enter, and then go over to yes, and restart your computer and launch it normally. So that is how you easily get into BIOS on your Windows 10 or 11 computer. So hopefully this video did indeed help you out. If it did, go ahead and leave it a big thumbs up and subscribe down below.